of our devotional reading. And today we are going to read about how we can pray to God in perfect privacy. A little privacy. Elijah was afraid and ran for his life. He himself went a day's journey into the wilderness. He came to a broom bush, sat down under it, and prayed that he might die. I have had enough, Lord, he said. Take my life. I am no better than my ancestors. Then he lay down under the bush and fell asleep. All at once an angel touched him and said, Get up and eat. Elijah was at the end of his rope. He was exhausted and frustrated. But notice what Elijah did before he cried out to God. He walked off into the wilderness by himself. Sometimes it's a good idea for us to spend some time alone so we can pray and hear from God. Jesus said that it's good to pray in private, to be alone with God. See Matthew 6 verse 6. Jesus modeled this himself. Before he was arrested, he left his disciples so that he could talk to God alone. Think about this. Jesus, who was perfect, knew that the fodder was the best place to unload the things that were breaking his heart. Only God can bring peace to our hearts. Jesus came into the world to make peace between us and God. When we bring our hearts to Him, He will hear us and refresh us. Would you like to pray with me? Dear God, thank you for sending Jesus to make peace between me and you. Please help me to make time to spend alone with you, especially when I am sad angry or worried. Amen.